Miguel Iterati here at the iBot Vault, and we're going to go ahead and hit you with a boxing blog. There's a lot of boxing, obviously, on the calendar uh, for the weekend of 626 and 627 here, end of June. Uh, July 4th weekend, not very heavy in the States for boxing, so uh, we're going to take this week and uh, probably take the next week off on boxing blogs. At any rate, this week we got a couple international lines coming up. The first one comes up uh, from Bangkok, Thailand, where the IBF World Flyweight title is on the line. Champion Amrat Runrong, uh, he's at minus 475. Uh, he's favored over John Riel Casimero, who's at plus 325. Interesting fight there. Uh, the flyweights and uh, the lower weight classes sometimes don't receive uh, the credit that they deserve. Uh, that one may be worth watching. Uh, the line isn't hideously huge either. Uh, the big show is at the Echo Arena in Liverpool, though, and uh, we've got a big card there that should air on TV in the United Kingdom. Four of the fights for that uh, show have popped up at the books. The main event features uh, the vacant WBC silver title in play for super middleweights uh, Callum Smith and Francis Christopher Rebrasi. Uh, Smith undefeated from Liverpool, big favorite, minus 1,700 over the veteran Rebrasi, who's at plus 1,100. Um, the co-main event has Rocky Fielding, also undefeated, going for the vacant WBC international title. And uh, he's a little bit of an, uh, obviously has a tighter line, minus 370, uh, as he takes on veteran Brian Vera. Vera is really on the downside of his career. He's coming off a couple of uh, losses. He participated in some pit fighting stuff. And he's a plus 310. I think he's out there for the paycheck. The cool thing is that uh, in September, if Fielding and Callum Smith win, they're both super middleweights. So if, in, if they both win, they will be fighting each other. Uh, for the BBC's uh, uh, British title uh, in a September main event. So the promoters got them both on the same card. He's doing some work there. The other two matches that are up at the books, Tony Bellew, minus 13,500, facing Lubo Suda, plus 3,500. Bellew coming off the emotional win over uh, rival Nathan Cleverly back in November. This is his first fight back, and um, we'll see. Uh, he's expected to win, obviously, and uh, then we'll see where he goes from there. Obviously, he'll be looking for bigger fights. And uh, the other veteran on the card, same line, minus 13,500 favorite, Martin Murray, uh, as he takes on George Berishvili, who's at plus 3,500. Uh, Murray obviously coming off the loss to Gennady Golovkin. This is his return fight, so he gets a, a softer opponent as well. Anyway, it's a great card. There are other fights on the live card if you happen to be in Liverpool. If not, those are the odds that are at the books, and we'll talk to you after the fight.